Hi, this is question number 12 from gate day 2024. Uh, this is a one mark MCQ question and this question is from probability. So three fair coins are tossed independently. Okay, so there are three fair coins and we toss, the, toss them independently. T is the event that two or more tosses result in heads. Two or more tosses result in heads. So let's say there are three, three coins. So T is the event in which you are getting either at least two heads, which means you are getting either head, head, tail or head, tail, head or tail, head, head or head, head, head. Either all three are heads or at least two of them are head. So these, this is the event T. We know that the sample space contains eight outcomes, right? The, you can very easily say that like the sample space contains eight outcomes from head, head, head to tail, tail, tail. It has eight outcomes. And this is your event T. Any event is just a, uh, just a subset of the sample space. Cool. S is the event that two or more tosses result in tails. Two or more tosses result in tails. So the event S is given as uh, two, you should have at least two or more uh, tails. So uh, S is like tails, tails, heads, or tails, heads, tails, or heads, tails, tails, or tails, tails, tails. This is S. So what is the probability of the event T intersection S? So T and S have nothing in common, right? So T intersection S is phi. T and S, uh, S have nothing in, com in common. Why? Because T is saying that you should have at least two heads. S is saying that you should have at least two tails. You cannot have both because there are only three coins. So T intersection has, S is phi, it is an empty set. So the probability of T intersection S will be zero. It is zero upon eight, which is zero, okay? Hi, if you want to register for GATE CS or DA, you can go to the website ravindrababuravla.in and all our courses are on the website. And if you go for live classes, you are going to get live classes, live doubt, such, uh, doubt clearing. And after the classes also, there is doubt clearing. <clears throat> Every day you are going to get practice questions and there is test series with GATE CS and GATE DA. And if you want to do masters abroad, you can take study abroad program. Okay, thank you. Hi, on 10th of March, we are having All India test for both GATE CS and GATE DA. So the reason for having this test is so that at the beginning of the preparation, you will know where you stand in the competition, your rank, you will know that. And then at the end of the preparation, I mean, every month we are going to have one test. And at the end also, we are going to have all India test so that you will see what you are, how you are improving and where do you stand in the competition. And if more students write this exam, then the results will be very accurate. They will be almost as like a gate exam. So just to encourage more students to write this exam, we are having cash prizes also. If you get first rank in gate CS, you are going to get 50,000 rupees. If you get first rank in gate DA you are going to get 50,000 rupees okay and now how to write the test is you, you go to test series on the website ravindrababuravla.in go to ravindrababuravla.in and you go to test series and then you are going to get free test series and in the free test series And in the free test series, you can see all India gate exam, view details. Then you are going to see two gate tests. 10th March, 10 a.m. is gate CS test. And 10th March, 2 p.m. 2 p.m. is gate DA test, okay? So don't worry, I will not make your ranks or the results public. I will not post your name with your marks anywhere. I will keep, keep them confidential. And uh, if you want to find out your results, uh, the number is available in the website, WhatsApp number. You can WhatsApp us and we will send the results only to you. Okay. Thank you.